Y'all, not me realizing the footage that you're about to see was all with my head cut off. I wasn't gonna re-record it. We, we showing the realness out here, but here you go. Good morning, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you're at, welcome back. I'm the Curly Doc. It's morning for me. I'm waking up crusty, dusty, but ready to get my hair washed for the day. Yes, this is going to be yet another Rev Air video, but I want to give an honest review and I have a story time for you. So basically real quick, because I'm gonna give you the short version then hop in the shower to wash my hair. But I was about to return the Rev Air. I sent them the email being like, yo, can you send me the box, the code? Because basically they send you return shipping label. And in their customary form, I think they have like email templates basically built to make people not return <laughs> the item because that would be a huge loss of, you know, revenue for them. So somehow, some way I ended up getting these samples, sampling of the shampoo and the conditioner. And it's part of their line. And they said that maybe using these products would help. So we'll see. I'm testing it out to see if the outcomes are different here. But also they said a couple of other things that I'm going to do a little differently in this video, where one is they said you can actually use whatever regular regimen you typically would use. So me using the oils wasn't a problem the first time around, which makes sense because my hair was a lot softer the first time around than it was when I did it the second time without oil. So they probably need to update their instructions in the instruction manual to tell you you can use whatever products you want. Secondly, the person in the, who responded to me, the customer service agent, holds, they said that I could, should use this bottle, I guess, which is why they provide it, that the machine actually works better the wetter your hair is when you put it in the machine. So my hair was definitely drying out a little bit as I was getting towards the ends, and honestly, even at the start, because I had let my hair air dry a bit. So, I'm gonna do it a little differently. You know, this is not a channel where you're coming in the shower with me. So you're probably next gonna see me once my hair is already prepped and all that good stuff, ready to just hop in and try the rubber again. Here, I'm trying to make this be actually quick. So as I had said, I prepped my hair, 12 sections, six on each side. I used the Rever conditioner and my handy dandy trusty magic oil, link in the description box if you have not tried it yet. You are slipping, that oil is the truth. So here we are. Thank you all for all of you who gave me the advice of things I can do to make the outcome of this better. And we're just gonna hop right into, into this because <laughs> I know my intro was mad long last time. So here we go. So I wanna make sure the hair is wet. That's what the makers of the product suggested and that's what some of you suggested in the comments before. Oop. All right, so my hair is wet, moisturized. We're doing level seven te tension and level two heat. And I still don't have heat protectant, but so far my hair has been looking all right, but I will eventually try to get heat protectant, especially if I'm keeping this. But here we go. Honestly, I was really hoping this was going to be my like, oh, I'm keeping it. <sighs> uh, it is stretched. It's dry, but it's crinky curly. Like you can see the crinky curls, but it does feel way more moisturized. Um, and I still need more of a trim, but I'm not in the mood for that. I'm, I'm really disappointed. Uh, you can probably tell like my voice completely changed. I can't hide that. Like this came out, like I'm looking at a mirror over there. <laughs> if you see, if that's what I'm looking over there. Like it's cranky, like obviously it's stretched, right? So we're gonna compare, like it's stretched. It looks healthy up until the ends that we're gonna ignore. But yeah, I don't know. I think I'm gonna turn it. It's been 
fun though playing with stretched hair for a little bit but this is the curly doc channel after all and i've been kind of missing styling my hair curly so yeah i think this is this is actually it for me i'm gonna send this back because i'm traveling to portugal um in a week and i need to return it before then because the date deadline for me to return this is in the middle of my trip so yeah all right so i'm just gonna kind of speed through the rest and we can see what it looks like at the end final end product but I kind of just want to get this done because I have stuff to do today. So see you in a minute. All right. So crazy thing, crazy thing, right? So I stopped recording because I literally was so over this machine. And then guess what? My hair came out amazing. <laughs> Yo, tell me why did my hair come out literally so good? And I'm just going to cut to that footage because I'm like, yo, this is wild. This is wild. The Rev Air has really put me through all kinds of emotions, happiness, sadness, grief, disappointment, not being shook, maybe being shook. I don't know. Who knows? But let me just show you the results of why I'm loving my hair. The machine, I'm going to give it a 3.5, a 3.5 stars out of five. And I may make a whole separate video on that, but just let it say I'm keeping the machine. My hair looks amazing. The machine itself is not all that great and it's very expensive, but here are the results. This is my genuine reaction. Just like when I finished doing my hair, I was like, oh, hold up. We're getting shine. We're getting body. We are getting all of the things. Yeah, so I had to then just, you know, do a little shimmy, 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 shimmy. We got that hang time. <laughs> look at it, look at it, look at it. I was really feeling myself. You can't tell me nothing. So this is the only footage I got from that day where I was like, oh my gosh, I am loving my hair right now. My hair is looking so good, so healthy, which is why I said like, I think my hair 10 out of 10 tends across the boards maybe we might, we might take like a 0.5 off because i need a trim but otherwise no this hair is giving but the machine it's not all that great but you know we keeping it because wow look at this look at it 